Hello. Hello, Jacqueline. Hello, David. How are you? I'm good. I'm good. Nice to see you. How was your day? It was uh, very tired. Yeah. Uh, I'm sorry. All right. Tell them, tell them not to speak Spanish around you, okay? <laughs> <laughs> it's my grandma. <laughs> yeah, tell her. Grandma, don't speak Spanish around me. Okay? Yes. Yeah. Spanish. All right, so... <laughs> So so, how was it? How was it? Why why was it like? It was it was very tired, but because I'm teaching 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 uh -huh. teaching teaching uh, at my replace my replacement. Oh. How to do all the things. Well, well, you know. Right, right, right. You're training. You're training. You're. Uh, your successor, right? Yeah, uh, yes. But... Okay, all right. Hey, very no. good. So, so, did you get the job? Uh, they don't call me yet, but I wait for it. Okay, they haven't called you yet. Okay, all right. Ah, you'll get it. Don't worry. All right, it's nice. To see you. <laughs> all right, how are you, Ever Campos? Hi, how are you? I'm um, good, man. I'm really really good i'm really tired but okay but i'm happy man i'm always you know try to be happy so um so how are you how was your day uh, my day is very good because today was my free free day of my job oh today was your day off you mean today exactly today i had my day off okay all right exactly. remember don't say betty right very Right, that would be very, very, uh, very. okay. Very. No, 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 not very. All right, very, right, like you go like this, very, very, all right, all right, easily. Right. Like, right, that, uh, that, R, that R is like this, okay? It's like when, when you have you ever heard a pirate? How, how, yeah, you know, what is it? How, how, what's the sound that, that a pirate makes? They go like, ah, right, yes. Yes. Oh, R. right. So, R. okay. Very, right. Very. Very. All right. All right. All right a little bit. Okay. Oh, you're getting some, some. You're getting there. <laughs> all right. What about you, Rusty? How was your day? Hello, teacher. You can hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Okay. Uh, so, my day is a little stressed. I don't know how is the pronunciation. Stressing. Stressing. My day but was very we, stressful. Mm -hmm. But um, everything is okay. But everything is okay, right? I like that, okay, right? Very positive. Thank yeah. you. All right. Uh, what about your day, Ricardo? How was your day? Good evening. Good evening, sir. Yeah, well, this day was uh, hard. But I'm I'm good. Okay, all right. Well, hey, you have to be. We have to be thankful that we have jobs, right? Even if we have to to work a lot, but we have to be thank you to you know for having a. Uh, we have to be thankful for having uh, jobs, right? Very good. So welcome everybody. Right, nice to see you. Uh, nice to see you, uh, Jorge, Ana. Welcome back, Eduardo. Always good to see you, Isaac, uh, Esther, Leo, nice to see you. Hey, Leo, I mean, Ricardo, you look familiar, man. I don't know, maybe you look like somebody I know, I, I, I met once, or I don't know, I've seen you around. You look familiar. I, I arrived uh, to working. Uh, you what, Leo? Hi, uh, everybody, everyone. Um. How are you? <laughs> All right, we're, we're good, man. We're good. How about you? How about yourself? Uh, nice, nice, nice. Thank you. Okay, all right. Very good, guys. All right, so let's get started, guys. We're going to continue. Uh, so yesterday, guys, we saw uh, phrasal verbs, right? Guys, do you all know how to rewatch the videos, how, how to rewatch the class on the from the YouTube channel? Do yes. you all have? Okay, very good. Very good, guys. Very good. All right, uh, 
in the email you received, guys, you should have you uh, you should have gotten this uh, this link uh, with the playlist of the YouTube channels. Okay. All right, guys. So yesterday, guys, we were seeing um, you know how to use two part verbs. Okay. So what are two part part verbs, guys? How do we call them? How do we call that? All right. I will call Pizza Hut and send you a pizza if you tell me how do we call how we call that. Colossal <laughs> verbs. But with your money, okay? <laughs> okay, we call them phrasal verbs. Good job. Plus oh, phrasal. Very good. Okay, phrasal verbs. Right. Where's my pizza? <laughs> well, right. we say that you have to pay for it, right? All right. <laughs> later, later, later. Right. Very good. All right. So yes, guys, we call them phrasal verbs, right? All right, so you got five seconds, guys, to tell me one phrasal verb that you have heard. You can tell me the ones that we learned yesterday, or you can tell me, like, the phrasal verbs that you have heard around or that you heard in movies, okay? Rocio, five, four, three. Turn off, pick up. Turn off, pick up. Very good job, Rocio. Good job. Uh, Eduardo, let's go. Give me one. Five, four, three. Up. Pick up. Uh, yeah. Pick up. Uh, okay, two and a half. Um, love, off, around, on, in, inside. Oh, oh wait, 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 wait. Guys, are those phrasal verbs or are those prepositions? Prepositions. Those are prepositions, right? Phrasal verbs. Remember, a phrasal verb has a verb and another word, right? So, um, so if if you don't have that, then it's not, it's not a phrasal verb, right? Very good, guys. So, uh, let's see, Leo, Leo Alfaro. Okay, so give me another one. Give me another one that you learn. Huh? Um. I'm sorry. Um, I see the video and understand. Uh, only, only. Um, um, only see the video and don't understand. Okay, you watched the video, but you did not understand. Okay. Yeah. yeah. All right. So we're gonna. I I I suggest to rewatch the video again. So, uh, because we're talking about a verb composed by two words okay so a two 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 word verb okay so those that's a phrasal verb which is something that changes the meaning but i recommend you to watch the video so you, we can take a look at that okay because we gotta we gotta do an exercise right now and you guys have to know phrasal verbs but what i recommend you doing guys i'm gonna make you practice together okay so i'm gonna get you together with another person and you are and that person can explain to you you know can give examples about phrasal verbs right we're good Right. Now, can you please repeat it? Slow down. Can, can, I, can I please repeat what? Uh, a, a little bit slow. Uh, that we're gonna practice. Uh, hold on. Uh, we're gonna we're gonna. Uh, oh, there you go. I think so. All right. So that we're gonna practice together, guys. So we're gonna couple up, and uh, we're gonna solve an exercise together. I was saying. I was telling Leo that. That a nice cat. Who's cat? All right. Um, I was telling Leo that because uh, he says that he did not get, you know, what the phrasal verbs are. Uh, whoever practices with Leo, uh, do me a favor and just explain them, kind of explain what phrasal verbs are, okay? All right. So, all right. So, let's continue with examples, guys. So, Jorge, all right, give me your example. Tell me one phrasal verb, uh, phrasal verb that you lear you've learned so far. Four hit. Five, four, three. Turn on the radio, teacher. Turn on. Very good. Turn on the radio. Very good job. That is good, uh, Jorge. Ana, give me one that you learned. Uh, remember that you're muted. You're muted. We can't, we can't hear. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Uh, put off. Put off, right? Very good. Okay, put off the meeting. 
Very good. Okay. Uh, Isaac Morales. Good job. Good job. Good example, Anna. Isaac Morales. Okay. Give, give me another one cool. that you learned. Cool. Uh, jump in. Jump up. Uh, hold on. Okay. Uh, very good. Hey, I like it. You're very knowledgeable about phrasal verbs, but pronunciation. Hold on. Right. All right. That. Cool. Hold on, right? That final consonant. Aside from that, that was very good. Esther, right? Give me one example, Esther. Break down. Break down. Very good job, right? Uh, Ever Campos, give me another example. Put away. Put away. Good job. Uh, Mauricio, give me another example. Uh, clean up the bedroom. Clean up the bedroom. Raul Francisco, give me another example. Raul, five. Four, three. Pick four, up your things. Pick up your things. Very good job. Victor mm -hmm. Cubias, give me another example. Uh, hang out. Hang out. Very good job. Okay. Uh, let's see. Jocelyn, give me another example. Jocelyn. Oh, you're muted, Jocelyn. No sonido. <laughs> uh, Turn the computer down. Turn, okay, turn the computer down or turn down the computer. Very good. Maria, give me another example, Maria. I don't know. Is uh, I late. I don't know. What do you say? Oh, okay. We're talking about phrasal verbs. Do you remember phrasal verbs? The last class? Yeah. Yeah, from the last class. Yeah. Last from yesterday's class. Yeah. Uh, I don't remember. Okay, don't worry. Take your take your notes, okay? All right, very good. Lino, okay. give me another example, Lino. Okay. Mm, turn off the cell phone. Very good. Turn off. All right. Repeat turn off. Turn off. Turn off. Repeat off. Turn off. Turn off. Turn off. Very good turn job. Off. Very good job. Alan Javier, give me another one. Uh, pick up your phone. Pick up your phone. Very good job. An applause for you guys. Beautiful. Good job. All right. All right. So we're going to move on, guys. So we're going to work together now, and you're going to do this next exercise. Okay. So what you're going to do, guys, is you are going to look at the following pictures, and you are going to choose the right piece of vocabulary for each of them. For example, is it pick up, pick up the books, pick up the toys, pick up the radio, pick up your jacket, pick up the TV, all right? Which, which is the right vocabulary for this, okay? So you will have uh, six minutes, guys, to practice this together. Do we have any questions? All right, mm. just, just for you guys, if you came late or if you were not in the class, please, 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 number one, <laughs> all right be be early right <laughs> be early but if you because can't be early guys all right uh watch the video guys okay watch the videos on youtube okay because you can re-watch the class there right so now remember phrasal verbs uh, a quick recap guys of phrasal verbs all right all right pick up pick up the book get up uh loosen up um go away all right move move over do over uh shake up shake it up right shake up um so on and so forth guys there are like a thousand of them right so anyways guys phrase verse remember it's uh it's a verb composed uh, com it's, it's actually two words a verb composed with another word okay so we got pick up right pick is the verb and then up would be the word that transforms this into a phrasal verb all right all right guys so let's work together and uh i'll be watching you okay let's go Hello, Leo. Hi, hi, Raul. Hey, Raul, do me a favor. Uh, 
could you, uh, if Leo has questions, could you help me um, answering the questions for the, for him about phrasal verbs? Yeah, the question in the light form. Yeah, do you know what phrasal verbs are, Raul? Uh, okay. Okay. Um, no, no, lo que te decía es que si entendiste, eh, si estuviste en la clase ayer y entendiste que eran los phrasal verbs, eh, que me hagas el favor de darle a Leo si tiene alguna pregunta con eso, ¿ok? Ah, oh, ok. Uh, Sobre ese ejercicio, sí, lo completé. Oh, ok, all right. Okay. So, so uh, I don't know if, if uh, Raúl completed the exercise, uh, but if you haven't, uh, Leo helped him complete the exercise, and Raúl help them with the phrasal verbs, ok? Okay. All right. Let's work on it. Thank you, baby. Yeah, no problem. Up. First, uh, you see the pictures. Two parts better. Okay. No, no. Oh, cual, cual sería? Oh, beautiful <laughs> Spanish. Oh, sure. Ah. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, pictures. <laughs> um. Not by far. Right. 142 lessons. No, 1.4. 1.4. <laughs> ah, okay. That's 1.4, right? Very good. Okay. Um, the Clean the jar, jar up, please. Right. Number four. Please, uh, please put the book. You good, guys? Um, any questions? Yes, teacher. Yeah, sure. Tell him. No, no, no. We are okay. Oh, you're okay? All right. Very good. Thank you. Very See you, Esther. All right. Very yes. good. Yes. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah, no. Para la reunión, ma. Beautiful Spanish. Woo-hoo. <laughs> in Spanish, sir. You put off the meetings. <laughs> teacher. Teacher, tell me. Eh, pick up eh, is similar eh, with bring. No, pick up is okay. So I have, I have. Uh, <laughs> I don't know yes. why I have this. Oh my god! Okay. <laughs> so pick up is like okay. This is like pretend. This is the floor, right? I'm gonna pick it up, right? Yes. I'm picking this up. Yes. All right. So that is pick up. Bring, bring is not picking. Bring is like, I already have this, this thing right here, right? I have this, all right? And I'm gonna bring it with me, okay? <laughs> Sorry guys, you got yeah. like tools because I don't know, I like, yes. I like that paper. Huh? tell me. <laughs> I bought okay, it like yeah. Albaniza. No, I just kidding, it's just like, <laughs> uh, okay. <laughs> I bought I, it from Galvaniza. <laughs> No. <laughs> in 2007. Uh, oh, okay. Yes. All right. Guys, do you have, do you have any question? Uh, any exercise? Teacher, um, uh, uh, could you please uh, explain what is the difference in two, four in, in this topic? Uh, Two four for for use in pick up uh, with the different preposition on in of what mm. else? Let me. I am not quite sure if I understood what you're trying to to ask of me, but I think that you're trying to say you want me to explain to you each the meaning of each of the different phrasal verbs. Okay, but in this case, we are going to pick up case, with... Case. Not okay, case. In this case... Case. Uh-huh. Case. Uh-huh. Uh, pick up is a verb. Or it's phrase. Pick up uh, is a phrasal uh, verb. Okay. Pick is the verb. Pick up is a phrasal verb. Okay, uh, uh, yesterday at night, you, you say the, the sentences, could you delight the meaning? 
in this case, but you, uh, you use, you, you put, put off. Put off, yes, uh-huh. That is right. The light is put off. Why is it put off? Or similar. <laughs> I am not, not understanding what you're asking me, I'm sorry. Okay, hold on. All right, I'm gonna maybe okay. Uh, I'll speak Spanish this one time, okay? What I'm understanding is that you're asking me. Yo le digo que hablar español es hablar inglés, right? Now, lo que estoy entendiendo es que ustedes me están preguntando por qué es, por qué se dice put off, por qué delay se dice put off. Is that it or after? Yes. Eh. Okay, so... Es que yo entiendo ahí, eh, teacher, eh, perdón por el español, pero yo entiendo ahí que el put off se puede utilizar en lugar de, de delay. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah, mm -hmm. Exactly. Eh, eh, ah, ¿cuál es, la no sé cuál es la pregunta, perdón. <laughs> ok. Y, y este, por ejemplo, y el pick up, ¿podemos utilizarlo de la misma manera que utilizamos el delay? In que ejemplo? I'm not understanding. Pick up. Okay. You mean pick up is like to grab something. Okay. So if you want to find a synonym, I mean, everything has a synonym. So yeah, of course you can use it like, you know, you can, uh, if you say, okay, pick that up. Okay. Um, actually guys, I don't, I don't, I don't think of another, I can't think of another word that refers to pick something off the floor, for example. All right. Um, so, but yeah, I mean, pick up is like grabbing something, right? And bringing it up. Yes. Okay. Yes. All right. So, okay, guys, uh, don't get confused. Okay. You're doing this too overcomplicated. Se tiene que memorizar cuál es el significado de cada phrasal verb. That's it. Okay. 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 All right. Um, so, hay una cosa se puede decir de mil maneras, igual que en español, right? O sea, vos puedes decir tú, usted, vos, vosotros, right? Uh, so, uh, so it's the same thing, right? In English, you can you can say something in a different way. People usually use phrasal verbs. Okay, uh, you can say you can say um, I'm gonna sleep right now, but you can say I'm gonna go to bed, but you can say I'm gonna hit the sack, right? All of that means the same. Got it? So, okay. so phrasal verbs, you have to learn the meaning. Te tenés que memorizar el significado. No hay una lógica para eso. You just have to memorize it. Tienes que saber que pick up es la acción de hacer esto, right? Pick it up, right? So that is pick up. Got it? Okay. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. For thing and for people. Yeah, you can, you can, yeah, you can say pick me up, but, right? Pick me up at 8 p.m. That means, now that's another, okay, That uh, it's good that you brought that up because that, I'm going to explain this to everybody, okay? All right, so, so, so you're not the only ones with, with this, you know, with, uh, with the treasure here. Um, so we're going to go back right now and I'm going to explain that, okay? Because that's okay. a very good point, right? Very okay. good. So let me just explain to everybody. Did you finish the, did you finish the exercise? No. Nope. <laughs> All right, let's finish the exercise first. Right? <laughs> okay. But good questions, guys. I like I like it. Okay, good good job. <laughs> How are you doing, guys? Um, we we don't know. <laughs> no. What happened? Uh, -huh. uh we will try. We will try. Uh -huh. Okay. Hang. What is hangout? I'm not sure, David. What is the meaning of hangout? Hangout means to like hangout is like when you when you're gonna go out with your friends, oh, right? I can tell you, hey, do you want to hang out with me? If I oh, okay. if I ask you if you want to hang out with me if you, we can go out and have fun go out yeah, to like relax. go out 
Yeah, but to um, but it means to like to relax, okay, yeah. to have fun, right? Oh, okay. But I don't have sense about the the options that we have. Yeah. I'm sorry, I didn't understand that question. It doesn't. Okay. It doesn't make sense. It, uh, yeah. With the options we have. Yeah. The option we have. Oh, okay. I understand now. It's a, it, it's a hang, hang up, please. No, but that, okay, hold on. That's hang, that's hang up. All right, that's different. I thought that you said hang out. Hang up? Hang up is when you do this, okay? You have your you have your phone and you put it down like this, okay? That's hanging up. Or you have your toxic or toxic calling you and you don't want to hear them. <laughs> oh, my God. You hang up, right? Hang so up. that is hang up. It, it, it's like you a hang call. Up, not hang out. Hang up. Oh, okay. Yes, hang up. Okay. Maybe your jacket. But yeah, okay, all right. Well, let's 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 take a look. All right, scroll down, scroll down, and show me the exercise again. Can you see? Mm, no, I can't see yet. All right, scroll down. Keep scrolling down until we reach that. Where do you see hang up? I, I saw it there, but I think it was like down at the bottom. Please take off. Uh, to hang up. Here. Please hang blah, blah, blah up. Hang. Please hang. All right. You need, you need, all right, go up. Uh, um. All right, scroll up, scroll up. Hang up your, your jacket. Hang your no, jacket no, no, up. No, 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 hang your jacket you, up. Right? Uh, no. No, I don't know. Yep. All right, so. Hand you the boots. <laughs> All right. All right. Think about it. Think about it, okay? Oh, why? Yeah, I'll, I'll help I... you guys, but think about it. Try to figure it out on your own right now, okay? I'll be right back, guys. I'll be right back. Okay. Okay. Hold on. So. So, Jacqueline, Jacqueline, I, yes, yes. So I'm not Jacqueline. sure. I'm not sure really. Hang, hang, hang out is like a call. He oh. said, right? It's not like a like a call. It's more that uh, I don't know how can I explain to you. Um, is when you're. Toxic call. <laughs> <laughs> oh when your God. boyfriend is calling I... to you, I guess. Oh no, he's <laughs> no. not like that. <laughs> um, what other options we have? You have. I can't, books, I can't see all of toys, them. Radio, jacket, the TV, your boots. The jar, I don't know. The light, the trash, the door. The door. I am. No. Oh. The fact is, I don't know what is hangout. Hang uh, up. Well. Hang up. I don't know what is that. I, the, I would like okay. to know the meaning. Can you, can you, watching it in the Google Translator? Uh. I don't know. Please, please. Um, uh, Can you? Do I, I don't know how to say pasemos. <laughs> Another one. Okay. Oh, next. Number number eight. Next. All right, guys. So I'm back. Please take out. Please take out. Take I out. think it's the trash and this. The trash. All right, guys, so I noticed <laughs> that some of you ran into a couple of uh, into, into a couple of questions, guys. Okay, we got to move on, guys, so we're not going to be spending more time talking about, talking about this. But I do want to uh, I want to I clear up a couple of doubts that I heard, guys. Okay, so do my favorite guys pay close attention right now. Okay. All right, guys, so. Sorry. So phrasal verbs. Okay. 
Um, you, we already know what phrasal verbs are, right? Now, guys, a phrasal verb, guys, you were asking me, okay, first of all, guys, if I say put off, okay, put off, why does it mean to delay, right? All right, why, why does it mean to delay, guys? The reason why is because you have to Away late. memorize them, okay? You have to memorize the meaning, okay? So uh, pick up, guys, okay, pick up. Yeah, it makes sense, guys, when you, when you say pick up, you know, pick that up, right? But guys, the meaning, okay, the meaning has to be memorized, all right? There is no rule for that. The only way to know, guys, is by memorizing what it is. Got okay. it? Also, mm -hmm. guys, another thing, all right, a uh, phrasal verb has different, different meanings, okay? All right. So, for example, guys. All right, you have uh, makeup, right? Makeup, makeup is actually like like a lipstick, right? Mm -hmm. like, makeup, like making up your face, okay? Yeah. All right, it's like um, you know, like let's say like Imagine painting, idea. painting your face, right? But makeup also means to um, to invent, okay? Right, you're making up a story, right? So, uh, so if you see, guys, okay, they have different meanings, okay? The only way to know them is by memorizing them. Got it? All right. So there's no rule for that, guys. You gotta got to memorize it. them, okay? Okay. Beautiful, Beautiful guys. Okay, so uh, let's solve the exercises, guys, okay? All right, so uh, let me share the screen and we're gonna go through number one. We're gonna move on, guys, so. <laughs> All right, so number one, guys, pick up that what? What, what, is, what, what are we referring to here? Pick up. The toy. The okay, toy? pick up the toys, please, okay? Okay, that toy. Is it the toy or the toys? The toys, right? Very good. The that toys. toys. Okay, all right. Uh, turn, turn what? The lights. Turn the, the lights. Light. Turn the radio off. Turn the lights off, okay? Turn the, the lights off. Clean. The radio. The jar. The jar. The jar. The jar. The jar. Clean the jar up, okay? Clean the jar up, please, okay? Now, can I say clean up the jar? Would that be correct? And would that be mean the same? Yes. Yes. Yes, guys. Clear the, the, yes. the jar. The jar up, right? Please. Put the, put put the book. Away. The books. Put the books away, right? Everybody, please put the books away. The books. Yes. Put the books away. Okay. Right. What about turn down? Turn down the radio. The radio. The radio. The radio. Turn down for what? Right. Just kidding, right? Turn down. All right. Turn down. And the my radio. kids. The radio, yes. The radio. I'm in sorry. In my case, in my case, sorry, in my case, and two, I put the radio and the platform take the good. Okay. Uh, Wait, which one? Which one? Guys, it's, <laughs> it, it's platform, not platform, right? Platanoforma, uh -uh. platform, <laughs> right? Yeah. Right, platform. All right. Hungry, okay. I don't know, guys. I'm I'm <laughs> typing in. I'm typing in whatever you're you're asking me to type in, right? But, uh, but you can say put the put the books away. I mean, that's that's that makes sense, okay? All right. But uh, we'll see, guys. We'll see. So let's continue. Number number six, okay? Let's talk about number six. Your boots. Please okay. Take please take off. Take off, take your, off your boots. Take off your books, and that was correct. Was yes. that correct? Take I off. think it's the trash. The jacket. The jacket, guys. Take off, okay? Take off your jacket, okay? Your jacket. Your jacket, okay? Take off, guys. It's like, okay, I'm going to take off my picture. Sorry, it's no. number seven, your jacket. Number six, yeah, yeah. your books. It's number seven. Okay, right? Yes. Your uh, books. Now, guys, okay? Now, take off also means to take, you can say, actually, guys, you can say take your jacket off. Or take your 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 t-shirt off, uh -huh. okay? All right. It means, guys, to get rid. That's another phrase of it, right? It is to like if 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 I'm okay, if I'm gonna if I'm gonna remove my 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 t-shirt, right? I'm gonna take it off, right? So um, so that is it's correct, no? That would be that would be correct, right? Mm -hmm. So take off your books, right? That's a, that that has a different meaning, okay? That you're gonna grab them and you're gonna take them with you, right? Mm -hmm. All right, now hang up. Hang up what? Your jacket. Your jacket. Your jacket, okay? Hang up your jacket. 
Now, yes. you can you say can you say take off your jacket? Yes. 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 Right. Now, the only yes. reason why the answer is this guys, is because if you see the jacket is hanging up the chair. Got it? Yes. So, yes. hang hang your jacket up please, right? Very good. Please take out the trash. Trash. The trash. All right, very good, guys. Trash, not trash or oh, trash. Trash. Trash, trash. trash, right? Trash. Yeah. All right, please trash. let Please let the dog, the dog. The dog. Right. The dog. Who, like the song, right? Who let the dog out, right? Who, Who let the dog, the dog out? out. Uh -huh. All right, uh, turn on the TV. Light. TV. The light on the light. TV. The light. TV. The TV. Turn on the TV. All right, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Right? Very good. Okay, so we're going to clean up. Clean the jar up, please. This would be okay, guys. Um, take off. Okay, so we these two guys, what is number three? Jar, jar, the 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 jar, guys, guys, the jar, 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 has nothing to do with a yard. Repeat yard. 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 Sounds like an e yard. The yard up. Yard. Clean the yard up. Yard. Repeat. Clean the yard up. Clean the yard up. Clean the yard up. Guys, completamente diferente la pronunciación que me estaban diciendo. Me estaban diciendo Clean the yard up. All right, uno, no me están diciendo esta vocal, nada que ver con la otra vocal, ¿ok? This is incorrect. Y no me están pronunciando la D. All right? Jar. All right, me yes. están diciendo jar. Jar. A jar. A jar is jar. this, guys, ¿ok? A jar is this. It's uh, like the right? whiskey in the jar. Like right? The now, the other one, guys, is yard. Yard. Repeat yard. 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 All right, you have to pronounce this and this, and this, uh, and this uh, consonant, this. Like a I, like an I, I yard, right? Yard, yard. So yeah. okay, this would be yeah. Okay, so this would be the the yard, okay? The yard. Please take off the boot. The boots, okay, right? That that makes sense. Okay, take off the, your boots, right? Your boots. Oh, your, all right. Your jacket. Your. You can say your jacket, your books. I mean, your 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 boots. Uh, you can say your your shirt, right, guys? When you are gonna remove your clothes, that's that. The meaning of that is take off, okay? Not take. All right. Okay. Very good. Okay. Also, take off means to, guys. Take off significa significa eh, remover tu ropa, all right? Take off significa significa despegar. Take off significa irse. I'm gonna take off, right? So you have to learn. You have to memorize all those meanings, okay? Okay. Very good. All right, guys, so let's move on. Uh, we'll already, we're going to talk about uh, two-part verbs, guys, and the stress in them, okay? What, is this, what do you understand by stress in words, guys? What do you think that means? The words that we use when we pronunciate, I think, the uh -huh. word. Very good job, guys. So we're going to talk about intonation, okay? Real quick, guys, okay, we're going to do a quick exercise. Now... So, um, this is this is a little bit small, guys, but uh, do you see, guys, do you see, like, these are big circles, right? And yes. these are, like, small, like, 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 small circles, right? All right. So, let's do a small practice, and then you'll, you'll understand, okay? We're going to, we're going to do the, do it like this, okay? So, the pattern, the, the, the intonation pattern, it goes like this, okay? Let's say, da. Whatever, whatever is in uppercase, guys, that has a higher intonation. Yes? Lo que yo escriba en uppercase va a ser con una intonación más alta, right? Okay. Uh, all right. So how would you, how would you say this? Would it be da 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 da, or would it be da 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 da, or would it be da da da? -da? What do you think? How do you, how would you read this? ¿Cuál es la intonación? Gente que Gente que toca música, ¿cómo sería? Everybody, Everybody, repeat. Who 
Who, plays, da, da, da. who knows music here, guys? Who knows music? Who knows about, about music? Quem conhece a música? Nobody? Nobody. 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 Oh my God. I'm just Nobody. a little bit teacher. Nobody. 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 In general. Okay. <laughs> Right. I know, oh, I'm a musician. The common okay. thing. Teacher Isaac, hand your hand. Mm -hmm. uh, Isaac, Isaac, what? Isaac. I'm a musician. Oh, you're a musician? Yeah, I have my guitar. Very good. Hey, I, wanna, I have a guitar too, man. Very good. Very good. <laughs> All right. So, Isaac, what would be Tell the me. what would be the intonation here? Oh, uh, this sounds like a uh, da 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 da. Very good job, exactly, guys. That added that. Very good. That added that. Very good. Now, everybody, go like this. Pick out the toys. Repeat. Pick out the toys. Pick out the toys. Right. That added that. Right. That added that. Right. Pick out the toys. That added that. That Turn off the lights. 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 Guys. Okay. Right. Now, notice something, guys. Okay. So. Turn off the lights. Pick up, guys. Okay. Pick up. Is the uh, the what? What is this? Pick up. What is that? Pick up. Pick up is the truck. <laughs> pick up, guys. <laughs> pick up, it's guys. A is a phrasal verb. Okay. <laughs> Solo All right. Very good. So this is <laughs> this is a phrasal <laughs> verb. Okay. All right. What is it, guys? Pick up. Verb. Pick up. It's a phrasal verb. It's okay? a phrasal verb. Phrasal verb. Phrasal and verb. toys, guys. Toys is the. The noun. The noun. The noun. The noun. Very good job. Okay. The noun. Now, notice in this case, guys, pick up received the same intonation, the same the same stress, guys, as um, as the noun. Okay. Yeah. All right. Pick up the toys. Right now, what about this, guys? What about the second example over here? Uh, somebody has a lot of noise in the background, guys. I'm gonna meet you all. Welcome to American Airlines. Very good. Yeah, there was like, I don't know, somebody's flying or something, guys. Very good. So, what about this, guys? The, stre the, the, the stress of the words, the stress of the pronunciation goes like this. All right. Da, 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 da. Okay, how, how would you, how would you, um, how would you stress that out? Uh, how, how would you stress that um, uh, we just read that. Uh, Isaac, how will you how will you stress it? Uh, da 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 da. Da 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 da. Okay, da 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 da. Very good job. <laughs> Very good, everybody. Da 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 da. Repeat. Da 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 da. Da 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 da. Da 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 da. Okay. Pick the toys. All right. So listen. Check this out. Pick the toys up. All right. Repeat, guys. Pick the toys up. Pick the toys up. Turn the lights off. Turn the lights off. Turn the lights off. Very good. Da 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 da, right? That that is the right. Da, da, that is the da. right stress, right? Da 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 da. da, right? da, da, da. Right? Pick the toys up, right? Pick the toys Pick up. The Turn the lights up. All right. The lights up. Now the next one, guys. Up. Next one, okay, right? Next one like this, right? Da da da, right? Da da da, right? Da da da, da. right? Da da da, right? Da da da. Da da da. Da da da. Pick them up. I played it down. Turn it off. Turn, Turn it, it off. off. Turn it off. Now, basically, guys, what I want you to understand here, guys, listen, take a look at the position of the phrasal verb and the noun, okay? If you start like this, okay, if you start with the verb and the complement for that phrasal verb, okay? All right, the intonation is the same, okay? The intonation here is the same, the intonation here is the same. Now, Guys. Let me ask you something. Do we have, do we have the, all right, guys, do we have the same phrasal verb here? Is this the same phrasal verb as this? Yes? Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. yes. Okay. Yes. All right. Now, pick and app. Do they have the same stress in the word? Yes or not? Yeah. Yes, yes, yes they do. All right. 
Okay. Now, this is, okay, so we have, first of all, okay, we have the first example. In the first example, we got the phrasal verb. Okay, we have the phrasal verb plus the noun, right? The phrase seller receives the first, I um, mean, the, the same intonation. In the second example, we have <laughs> the verb, we got the noun, and then we have, how do we call that complement at the end, guys? <clears throat> the, did anybody take notes? <laughs> Nobody took no. Now, how do we call, how do we call this part right here, guys? Phrasal verb. No, 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 no. This part, okay. Compliment. The second part of the phrasal verb. The noun. No, a particle. No. Particle. Very good job. A particle. Okay. Very good job. Okay. Particle. Okay. So particle. the verb and the particle receive the same stress. Okay. When we use the noun in the middle. In the third example, we have a verb, and then we have what? The no, 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 no. The pronoun. The, okay, very good. We got the pronoun, right? Not pronoun, pronoun, okay? Pronoun. pronoun. We got the pronoun, and then we have what? Particle. Particle. Okay, we have the particle, okay? Now, according to this, guys, where, okay, where would I put the stress here? Well, in the phrasal verb, guys, in the phrasal verb, I would put it, Remember, a phrasal verb is a, a verb and a particle, right? I would put it in the verb and the particle, okay? okay? All right. Okay, so over here, guys. All right, let me just uh, put it in parentheses here. Now, guys, over here, okay, where do, you, where do you put the stress here? Where do you put the stress in the word? And the verb. Very good. You put it here and you put it? Noun. In the particle, guys, okay? Yeah. All right. Verb and particle, okay? And, uh, on, okay, so on the second example, guys, where do you put the stress? In the verb and the particle. And the verb and the particle. In the third example, where do you put the stress? The verb, the verb. The verb and the particle. And the verb and, and the, the particle, verb. all right? Is it understood, guys? Is it clear? Yes. Very good, very good, okay? Stress in two parts, ah, okay. All right, all right, very good job, guys, okay? Okay, do you have any questions regarding that, guys? No. Yes, no? No. All right, we're gonna move on from okay. here. Uh, you're gonna do, guys, uh, you're gonna do the exercises on at home, okay? So by tomorrow, okay, you have to, to have finished this, okay? Now, we're going to we're going to jump into a more uh difficult topic okay which is requests with models all right now do you have any idea what a model is guys i think it's when when we request request something for um for example models. uh using please or can you please or will you or something like education or something like that i don't know very good, um, very good okay what, uh -huh. mm -hmm. actually yeah you uh jacqueline is right all right jacqueline jacqueline is right it's more complex than that than that but it, she's right okay uh who else has an idea guys uh you use a model birth for abilities uh Things like, uh, let me show because I can't remember, but it's something for abilities. Yes. Uh, <laughs> probabilities, I think. Abilities, okay. Abilities, probabilities, and things probabilities, like that. Probabilities, good job. Probabilities, advice, right? Yeah. Permissions okay. of something. Permissions, very good job. Permissions, uh -huh. okay. All right, within this realm, guys, we have words such as can, could, might, uh, should, um, would, will, what yes. else? Uh, will, mm, what else, guys? Cool. May. Okay, may. May, we got ought, shall, shall, 
All right, so we got it. We got we got we got a, a couple, right? Oh, wow. So we're not we're not gonna go through them right now because that's in you know uh, you saw that in previous topics. But guys, we're gonna use models yeah. to make requests. We're gonna use models to make requests. You were gonna use Request. models to make requests, okay? So taking a look at the first examples that we got here, guys. Where can you identify the models, okay? Where do you see the models here, guys? Can. All right, so we got the first one here. What else? Cool. Good, very good. What else? Cool. Wood. 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 Wood, okay, what else? Mm. I... Okay, we got wood here, we got wood here, we got wood here. Uh -huh. here. All right, so what is, what is, do you know what bold, bold, uh, bold is? Bold is in negrita, okay? All right. Well. So, so so can you see can you can you see the the words in bold letters like turn yes. and off what is yeah. that yeah it's a phrasal board it's a phrasal verb yeah, close uh -huh. all right close what okay close actually okay. It's, it's a verb guys okay close is a verb okay it's not a phrasal verb what about take out what is that it's a phrasal verb phrasal it's a phrasal verb, verb right mm -hmm. turning down what is that phrasal verb okay. phrasal verb okay closing a verb Right, a verb, right? Uh, pudding? Pudding. It's, it's a verb. It's a verb. Okay, all right. It's a phrasal. I mean, it's a verb, not a phrasal verb, right? All right. Is that clear? So far, so good? Are we yeah. following so far? Yes. Okay. Yeah. Beautiful, beautiful. Now, guys, so we know about models and we know about phrasal verbs, okay? So how can we make requests? So um, there are types of requests, guys, okay? And I'll give you an example. When you're trying, when you're trying to conquer someone, you're very, very polite, aren't you? Most of the times, right? It's supposed. All right. Or when you're talking to the president, right? When you're talking to the president, I don't know if you're ever going to talk to Bukele, but um, <laughs> when you're talking to someone important, guys, okay? All right. There are levels. There are degrees, guys. Degrees of politeness, okay? All right, what do I mean by this, guys? If I ask, if I tell you, hey, give me the jacket, or hey, uh, turn, down the, turn down the TV, is that polite? No, no it's not polite. Big word. Very good. If I tell you, hey, can you turn, on, can turn down the TV, is that more polite than just saying, turn, mm -hmm. down, turn down the TV? Yeah. It's a little bit. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. If I tell you, can you turn down the TV, please, is that more polite? That's more polite. Yes. If I ask you, could you turn down the TV, please, is that more polite? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. All right. Would you please turn down the TV? Is that polite? Yeah, really yeah. posh. Would you be so kind to turn down the TV? Is that more polite? Yeah, it's so posh. All right. Would you please do me a favor? <laughs> I don't know what it's like, <laughs> but okay. So, what I want to show guys is that there are levels of politeness, right? Mm -hmm. Just like in any language, all right? So, that's it, guys. So, if you don't want to be so polite, guys, okay? If you're not talking to, I don't know, someone you respect, guys, okay? I was going to say Bukele, but I don't know if you respect them or not. Okay. So, <laughs> okay. So, if I say this, guys, okay, can you turn, if, can you turn the, uh, the stereo off, okay? Oops. <laughs> can, or I can. <laughs> you, I'm sorry, guys. You kids like I've been working the whole day. <laughs> All right, very good. Can you turn the stereo off, okay? So, guys, if I say this, guys, uh, is this polite? Can yeah, it's a little bit polite, polite, but this is something like a lawyer, too. Okay, yeah. very good. I think I think it's more than, uh, more for something like when you're talking with a friend or um, a cousin or something like that, Okay, yeah, it's, yeah, exactly, right? I mean, I can tell my sister, hey, uh, can you turn the stereo off, right? Now, guys, if you are not going to be extremely polite, the structure, okay, the structure is down up there, but uh, I'll write it down here. So, first, we got the model. What is the model in this case? Can. Can. Very good job, okay? So, the model is right here, right? This is the model. Then, after that, we have... The simple form of the verb, right? Mm -hmm. Now, the simple form of the verb, guys, I would call that, you know, uh, 
you simply use a verb or a phrasal verb, right? So we have the model. Obviously, after the model, we have to use, um, we're going to use a subject, okay? So let's use a subject. What is the subject here? This area. You. Okay. We got, we got you, right? Now, after this, we got either a verb, right? Mm -hmm. They're a verb or a phrasal verb, right? So what is the phrasal verb that we got here? Turn up. Turn up. All right, turn off, right? Okay, and then these right here, what do we call that? Noun. Okay, that is a noun. Very good job, guys. You guys are pretty good. <laughs> nice, okay. Very good. So you got the noun. So far, so good? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. All right. So now... Let me ask you this. Are all these examples following the rule that we just discussed? Yes or not? Yes. Yeah. Yes, guys, they are following the rule, okay? All of them. If I say, would you please take your garbage out, right? It's following the same rule. Would, is it a model or not? Yes. It's a model, yes. uh -huh. It's a model, right? You, you, is it, is it a subject or not? Yes, it's a subject. Right. All right. Now, we can add, guys, words such as please, right? After, after, after the subject, you can say, could you please? Or you can say, would you take your garbage out, please? Coma, please, right? So you can say, you can say like this, guys. You can say, would, right? Would you please take uh, your garbage out <clears throat> or you can say okay. or you can you can say please at the end can you say please at the end yes right Probably. all right would you please right so you can say would you please take no oh, i'm sorry would you, would you, you take, take the garbage out the garbage, please? The, garbage the garbage out, out please. please okay please. now out and then coma please right coma all right. please all right very good very good, very good, okay. All right, so is that understood, guys? Yeah, of course. Yes. Very good job, very good job, see? All right, so tomorrow we're going to continue with the explanation of how to be even more polite, okay? Meanwhile, guys, uh, I want you to... Hold on. Can you turn the stereo off? Oh, okay. So what I want you to do, guys, okay? Uh, if you want to do it, okay, it's not an obligation because we have to finish the topic first. But I would like you to finish this exercise, 1.9. If you can, if you if you want to do it. If not, you can do it tomorrow, okay? All right, we're going to do it tomorrow either way. But I want you to just to do it, just to have an idea of, um, you know, how, how to use the models making requests, okay? Other than that, guys, um, it is time already. Hope you enjoyed yeah. the class, guys. Uh, thank you for being here early. I appreciate it. <clears throat> and... Uh, do you have any questions for me? No questions. <laughs> no, no questions. No. I have no idea what, what else to tell you. But we understand but it, a lot. This but, it's, class. but it's thank you guys. But it's it's been a pleasure being with you guys. I will see you tomorrow. Take care. High five, face bump. Right. Hi. Okay. There you right. go. See, see you tomorrow. tomorrow. Good night. Thank you guys. Bye. Good night. Bye. 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 Bye.